Hey, hey, everybody, what's up, what's up? Anthony Morrison here, and welcome to tonight's Success Connection. Hold on one second, I'll get my camera on and hopefully have everything set up and ready to go for you guys. Hold tight. There we go. Looks like I've chopped my head off here. Let's go back up. Oh, all right, so I'm sitting down tonight. You guys know I usually am standing up, but sitting down tonight uh, for our training. But want to welcome you all here and congratulate you on being here on the Success Connection. Uh, this is uh, this is an awesome, awesome uh, night to be here. We've got a guest that's coming on to do a special training for us. How many of you excited about that? Give me a big yes. Lots of yeses in the chat box. Want to see tons and tons of them? Very good. So want to uh, want to address a couple of quick things. Um, obviously, uh, we know that a lot of you are joining us from uh, from around the world, and uh, we also know clearly that the world is in kind of a state of panic as we uh, as we try to deal with the uh, with the coronavirus, the outbreak, and of course the situation at hand, uh, which requires a lot of people to use uh, to use their brains, you know, also act and uh, act responsibly, and then uh, and hopefully. You know we can get past this thing it's, it's it's another testament i think to why uh working from home having an internet business is uh is is, is such a, a i guess a luxury in life right um the fact that i don't have to go to work and be around a bunch of people and uh and i'm not torn with the you know with the you know should i go should i not um you know and, and for millions of, of of internet marketers around the world same thing and so it's just another testament to why I love what I do and why I love teaching you guys to do this and, uh, and why I'm so, uh, so excited, but also just, you know, feel so blessed to be able to do, uh, to do what we do. So uh, prayers and thoughts with any of you that have uh, family members who have, uh, who have been infected with this uh, or that are in areas where, you know, life is a little more difficult. Uh, where I live in, in Mississippi, there's really not a whole lot going on. I think we just had our first case a few days ago, and it was it's a good two three hours south of me or north of me. Uh, so we haven't really had much of an impact here, but I'm sure it's coming. And um, and so for that reason, uh, we're going to make a few changes to tonight um, because I want to give you guys some help. But I also want to do one thing for you or, or tell you one specific thing. Okay, we got some emails in our in our support box uh, this week that that kind of uh, for lack of better terminology, I'm just going to go call it spade to spade. This pissed me off. Um, there are people that are asking me how you can leverage this coronavirus scare and outbreak and pandemic uh, in your ads and, in, and, and to make money. And I've seen some really prominent marketers do that. I've seen some very big uh, Internet marketers that are using the coronavirus as a uh, as a means to get attention, get clicks. And, uh, and and hopefully be able to uh, to make money. I just want to tell you that when I teach you guys how to do things, I always try to teach you how to do them in an ethical way. And in no way, shape or form do I think that uh, using the attention that this coronavirus is, is, is given uh, to get clicks and make money is ethical. Um, there are thousands of people around the world that have died. And um, I'm not saying that uh, you can't live your life and, and uh and, and, and do the things that you do. But we do have to recognize the fact that there are people who have lost their lives uh, because of this. And um, ads with, with masks and coronavirus scares and stuff in it are simply just not in good taste. Um, so if it's something you were planning to do, do me a favor, don't do it. Um, and, uh, and if you see other people doing it, you should tell them how pathetic it is. Uh, some very big name marketers, marketers that people know, like, trust, and respect are uh, are doing that right now, and uh, I think they should be told that it's uh, that it's tasteless. So, um, with that said, we're going to make a few changes to tonight's training, uh, but we, but we've also got some really awesome things coming your way uh, tonight, and a and a guest trainer that's going to teach you how to do something that he's actually doing uh, for for us right now uh, at a really high level. But if you are a new student, uh, usually I have a, a, a slightly different welcome. So um, if you are a new student, welcome. Thank you for being here. I'm glad you took the time out of your day uh, or night, wherever it is that you may be, uh, to be here with us. And super important, I think it's great to have that outlet to get that news off, to get that negativity out. It's good to be informed, uh, but it's but it's better to be 
you know, to be focused on something positive and something that uh, that can truly help um, help you grow as a person, but also help your business grow, right? So if you're new, thank you for being here. Please understand that this training is not a continuation of anything else that we're doing. So this is not a continuation of, of any other program that you've purchased. This is a standalone training. This training stands by itself, works by itself, and um, and what we do is we build businesses together, right? And and we give you those businesses, and we help you launch those businesses. And you can use any of our trainings and any of our software to help these businesses that we're giving you uh, grow and reach new levels. Okay. And of course, if you've been here before, well, thanks for coming back and joining us, right? We appreciate it. Um, some of you asked me how how uh, my brother's house was. As you know, uh, a tree fell on it last week. Um, he seems to be doing good. He is rebuilding and uh, about four to six weeks before uh, before the, the, the house will be back in order. But uh, luckily, no one was hurt. He wasn't hurt. And uh, and we were, we're, we're in good shape. So at the end of the day, uh, we're thankful uh, that, that nobody was hurt in that. So with that said, let's kind of pull up. Pull up our 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 agenda, if you will. OK for for this week now if you are new it is very important that you always uh that you always you know understand that we continue to move forward each and every week but you can always go backwards a couple of weeks and get caught up okay uh it's oftentimes difficult if i spend the first i don't know 20 minutes 30 minutes recapping uh what we've done because then i can't get as much new stuff in right so currently what we're doing is we are building out a funnel okay and the funnel looks very similar like to this um, and the funnel allows you to sell a newsletter okay so it's allowing you to sell your very own newsletter all right now why do you want to do that because some very very big companies agora financial is one of them this is how they make their money they make it off of newsletters low low priced entry monthly continuity newsletters. It's called the Netflix model, right? It's how do you get as many eyeballs as you can to wanna to look at and have and obtain the information that you're selling, right? And then bill every single month. And it's been a phenomenal uh, part of our business. And, and I believe it will be a phenomenal part of your business when you, when you build this out, okay? And the funnel really kind of consists of multiple steps here. You can look over here where I'm moving my mouse. Uh, step one is the opt-in page, okay? And so the opt-in page is basically where someone lands after they click on an ad or click on a link or click on something somewhere, right? They land on this opt-in page. And what we're doing is we're getting them to give us their email address in exchange for something of value, right? So we call that the premium, all right? We call that the free premium. What is it that is really gonna move the needle? And I got some news for you. Um, and, and if you look right down here, it says that this week we're going to give you the free premium. So let's knock this out real fast. Here is the free premium that we're gonna start with, okay? Now I want you to check this out because this is really dope. All right, everybody can see this, this screenshot. It's, well, this is an image. Three reasons why you should not start a business on Amazon. Now, a lot of you are probably gonna say, what, what are you talking about? Let me tell you something. The number one angle that we're using on our ads right now is this right here. This is giving us some of the best results we have ever seen in our marketing is by simply saying, here are the reasons why you should not do an Amazon store. How many of you have seen those ads of mine? Just give me a big yes. Sounds like Chloe and Sophie have seen them. All right, I see some yeses. Very good, very, very good. Uh, the perils of working from home. You can't get rid of the little puppies. So, okay, so three reasons why you should not start an Amazon business. What we've done is, I've been bouncing back and forth and back and forth. And honestly, we've had some, uh, we've had some, you know, some of the people that work with us, some of the people that work for us have been, you know, look, there's, shutdowns here and there's travel delays there. And so we've had, we've been a little bit impacted by the global shutdown because of, uh, because of this coronavirus. So we haven't flowed this book for you yet, meaning uh, it's not put together where you could hand it to somebody just yet. 
We're going to give you the image tonight, okay, uh, that you can put on your opt-in pages and build your opt-in pages out. Now you might, but but next week we'll actually give you the full book, okay? So you'll get the full book flow that you can actually give away next week. Now you might say to yourself, well, how does that I mean? What does that even mean? Well, it's just one of the angles. Recall that I told you up here. I'll move this around, okay? Recall that I told you right over here where all of these are highlighted, right here, okay? These are all opt-in pages, okay? So I'll try to make my mouse big right there. Yeah, like you can see where this says Amazon profits. Okay, these are all different angles that all lead to the same thing. They all lead to a sales letter that's gonna sell somebody a newsletter that talks to them about building their internet business, having success, doing marketing, all of those types of things, right? That premium is what's gonna make them take action, give you their email address and move forward. Well, we feel like this is a great premium. The three reasons why you should not start an Amazon business, oh my gosh, you don't get the customer data, which means you don't build an email list. You have to go and find products, right, to sell, which means you're constantly spending a lot of time searching for what's hot. And then the third thing is pretty simple, and that is the profit margins suck, right? Like if somebody else drops their price, then you have to drop your price, and it's just those three things are a pain in the butt but they're a great segue, okay, into a newsletter that's talking about being able to build your email list or a newsletter that's talking about affiliate marketing where you're not having to go search for all of those products or a newsletter that's talking about building a digital agency or building your own digital products because then guess what? Nobody can adjust prices and, and, and screw up your profit margins. So this angle is gonna be a phenomenal angle in helping you be able to get the right customer in to convert them to a sale. Does that make sense to everybody? Just give me a big yes if it does. Okay, very, very good. I'm looking over here on the side and I see that. All right, so we've already built these opt-in pages for you, okay? And you'll recall that last week, okay? So last week I told you, let's see, uh, let me pull it up here. I told you that I was going to give you the seven new opt-in pages. You can see right here. I was gonna give you seven new opt-in pages bought from our students, okay? So you can see right there, seven new opt-in pages bought from students. So let's check that out. We have the opt-in pages done for you. You can see that this was the initial opt-in page that I built where you can put an image in here. Guess what? You can drop the image right here of the Amazon one, tweak this content, okay? to say, you know, obviously three reasons why you shouldn't start an Amazon business. And now all of a sudden you've got an opt-in page that's got a premium that all looks good and all works. Does that make sense everybody? Yes, awesome. But tonight you are also going to get all of the student opt-in pages. These are the opt-in pages that we bought from our students last week. So there's tons of them in here, there's seven. Uh, this is one of them right here. Uh, learn the strategies used by top influencers to grow and monetize your Instagram without paying followers or without paying for followers. I mean, check this out. Really cool page, already built out, and there's plenty of other ones in here as well. What that means is we've got the opt-in pages done, okay? And we're giving you those opt-in pages tonight, completely free. At the end, you can download them all. You get them all completely free, okay? So when we're looking at the funnel we have built out all of these opt-in pages for you all right so if i can all of this all of this right here in this red this is done okay so this stuff's done for you then obviously we've given you or we're going to give you a premium the free giveaway that's going to happen okay so the only other things that you really have to do is they're and they're listed kind of like right here maybe i can maybe this is a little bigger number one you've got to have a sales page that will convert those sales and number two you've got to be able to fulfill a newsletter what that means is you need to be able to write a newsletter okay now we've talked to you in the past and told you you can outsource this you don't necessarily have to do it on your own you can outsource it and let somebody else do it for you but how many of you would like to learn how to write a proper newsletter on your own? Just give me a big yes in the chat box if that's you. All right, I see lots and lots of yeses. In fact, if you are a member of our Facebook group, please, please go post in the Facebook group, tell everybody we are live, tell them you are live, tell them you are excited to be live here on the Success Connection. I wanna bring everybody in. I wanna be that little shot 
of, of excitement and of motivation and of positivity this week because I truly think that it's going to help you guys make more money and have more success and have a better mindset this week. So please post in the Facebook group right now for me. And look, I see tons and tons of you saying you want to learn how to write your own newsletter. And I figured you would. So I switched my plan up a little bit to fit my guest schedule. And so basically we've already done, and I'm going to relabel these. We've already done this part, which is the opt-in page. Okay. So we've done that part. We've given those to you. If you're a new student tonight, you're going to get those in just a minute. Okay. Then the second step of this is building out the sales page that's selling your newsletter. And the third part is understanding how to write a newsletter. And so tonight what we're going to do is we're going to bring in our resident partner with Anthony newsletter writer, if you will, um, and let him teach you what he's done to write such a quality newsletter for our partner with Anthony students. Um, the interesting thing is, is we've had so much positive feedback, so many people that are super excited, and there's so many ways that you can actually monetize the newsletters. So even though you're charging for this newsletter here, okay, so even though people are paying to get the newsletter, there's still opportunities within the newsletter to be able to make money. So how many of you would like to spend, let's see, I'm, I'm quick on time, maybe the next 20 minutes learning the structure of writing a perfect newsletter so that when you launch this business, boom, you're able to start fulfilling and making money. Just give me a big yes. Lots of yeses. I see him coming. Awesome. Well, then I must invite my guest to unmute himself and turn his webcam on. Our guest is, of course, Roger. He's cleanly shaved. He's, uh, he's, he's looking like he's ready to go somewhere and do something. I don't know. But Roger, <laughs> welcome to the well, Success Connection. <laughs> After the uh, Success Connection, I go to sleep. I don't know yeah. what y'all do on the East Coast, but I go to sleep, my friends. I do and watch them too. I do, I do watch them. I know so, you do. <laughs> I know you do. You text me about these Success Connection trainings, and you're like, what did you do this on that? And I'm like, are you watching that training? Like. What is going on? You are. It's good. It's good. It's awesome. So, guys, if you haven't met Roger, Roger's worked with us for a while now. He actually does a lot of our Facebook ads. So the Facebook ads that you see running, he does. Um, but he's also a copywriter. And so I, I went to him and I said, hey, man, we want to do a newsletter for our partner with Anthony students every single week. We want it to be inspiring. We want it to be educated. We want to increase our open rates every week. We want to get people excited about this every single week and he said yeah I'll, I'll take it on i'll do it and it's been a raving success and so when i started thinking about this newsletter business i thought to myself man you guys need to know how to write a newsletter and so i asked him if he could put together something to teach you how to structure a newsletter when you're writing it because understand that a newsletter just means all you have to do is literally send an email to people that's it you're getting paid $10 a month, $8 a month, $20 a month, whatever you charge for your newsletter. And you're getting paid that by like a thousand people. But you write one email and press the button, the send button one time. Pretty incredible ability to scale. How many of you would agree with me? Yes? And you can do it on many different topics. But tonight's focus is on internet marketing. Tonight's focus and, and the focus of this funnel is on internet marketing, building an internet business. That's what we do. That's what we teach. But you can apply these strategies to any kind of funnel uh, or any kind of niche that you want. So, Roger, what I'm going to do is turn it over to you for 20 minutes. I'm going to give you the screen. Let me uh, let me share the screen. Here it comes. As if by magic, I no longer have control of my own community. All right. I click show my screen, correct? Yeah, that would, that would work. That would work. That would that'd be the things that show my screen. That would All be right. the things that show your screen. All so right. everybody, give Roger your full attention. He is going to walk you through. Roger, we have about you know 20 minutes because I still have to be able to talk. I can't give up all my time on my right. success connection. That's I fine. I still have words to say. That's um, fair. It's your it's your thing, I guess. <laughs> but let's take it away, man. Let's let's talk about how to structure a newsletter that's going to help people to yeah. to to deliver great value to people once they launch these businesses absolutely all right well first of all i know a lot of you that are on this webinar are pwa members and so i just want to say thank you to you all who have shown immense support for the newsletter 
um, and have given me, more importantly, have given me a lot of feedback. You've sent me messages, um, had some questions, things that I, that I was able to answer throughout the newsletter and also things that were most helpful to you. Um, and I just wanna say right off the bat that the reason the newsletter has been successful is not because I'm a genius, because I'm not a genius. Um, the reason the newsletter has been successful is because I follow a specific format. I follow what works. When I want to do something, um, whether it's ads, uh, Facebook ads, writing a sales page, um, designing um, a page of some kind, I go and I see what's working, what's successful already, and, and model that structure. And then I start making tweaks based on my audience, based on the customers to see what they want to see and, and any changes that need to be made there. But guys, I just, I just follow what works. And so Agora Financial uh, has been mentioned a few times by Anthony now as, as a place for newsletters. I've been subscribed to Agora Financial for uh, almost a decade now and have been studying not just their stock picks, uh, which is what they what their newsletters are about, but just the, their marketing, the way that they write ads and specifically the way that they write newsletters. So the structure that you're going to see tonight is based off of newsletters that have done literally billions of dollars in sales. Um, and I've been applying them myself for my own newsletters and I do that a little bit for the PWA newsletter. Now, for those of you that have read the PWA newsletter, you'll notice that this isn't exactly the structure that I follow. And there's a reason for that. In the PWA newsletter, um, you're, not, you're not necessarily, like the, there's the program, there's the whole program that Anthony has put together and it's phenomenal. The newsletter is more of updates. So what you'll see in the newsletter are, are pieces of what you're going to see tonight. But I don't put the whole thing out there all at once because I don't want people to get overwhelmed. I would rather you focus on going through the modules and doing what Anthony has and then coming to Success Connection. So what you're gonna see tonight are pieces of what I give on the newsletter, um, but, but tonight you're going to see exactly how I would structure a full newsletter that someone is paying for, that, 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 that you are clicking send and they're paying for what they're receiving. This is how you structure that, all right? So without further ado, because I continue to ado and ado, let's get into the structure of a newsletter, all right? The first thing that we look at is what I call the personal opening. I'm gonna read a little bit of this and I'll also send this doc to anybody who would like to, who would like to have it for a personal reference. Um, the personal opening. So again, like the name implies, this should be personal. You want to open up by telling something about yourself. This can be as simple as give an update about what's going on in your life. Um, Anthony did that tonight on the webinar. He didn't want to go without saying, hey, here's what's happening with, um, with the virus, our thoughts and our prayers to all that are affected. Um, here's some ways to think through that as marketers, things that we don't want to do, things that are in good taste. It was very relevant. It was very important. And honestly, it was, it was from his heart. It was, a, it was from Anthony, who is a physical person. And that's what I'm trying to get at here. If someone is buying the newsletter from you, they're not buying a newsletter. They're buying the person that wrote that newsletter. They're buying you. You are on the other end of it. And it does matter what you did that day. It does matter what you've been researching in your business to come up with these ideas. It does matter how you came up with what you were going to share. Um, if you were recently, in another country, if you were traveling, if you were having fun, or if you were going through something that was a struggle, please open up by sharing that. Even if it's a, a few sentences, I guarantee your retention rate, which by the way, a retention rate is the amount of people that continue to stay onto your newsletter, that continue to stay subscribed, your retention rate is going to increase the more you're able to put yourself into the newsletter, all right? So that's your personal opening. Uh, give me a one if that makes sense. Okay, I'm seeing lots of ones because I feel like that's it's it's easy to understand. Uh, okay, and, and somebody said that's that's cool. I didn't follow that. Okay, cool, awesome. Glad I could share that with you. That that would be something that's important. So I know you know how to do that. We're gonna go right into the meat. The next thing that happens is you want to share your content. This is what they paid to read. Like I said before, it's important to open up with a personal note, um, but then right after that, make sure you get into what they what they came to see, what they're paying for, to let them know 
that you mean business. And I like coming out content heavy to start so that they see like, hey, this is something I can't get for free anywhere else. This is something that's that's really gonna be vital for my business. And, and, and this person on the other end of the newsletter, they know what they're talking about. So I'm gonna read it slowly. I might read it again and that's okay. Um, but come out strong on the content side of things. And I'll teach you how to get into that in just a second here. But like I said, for the content, this is the part where you're teaching something new to your audience. Um, this is something they simply cannot find anywhere else for free. So spend some time here. Now, because this section is so important, I wanted to break down a structure that I've used uh, in a lot of different contexts, not just in um, webinar teaching, but also um, when I used to give public speaking, when I used to do public speaking engagements, as well as when I write newsletters. And it's called the EIA formula. And it goes like this, it's explain, illustrate, and then apply. This is how you structure your content. You explain first, you illustrate what you've just explained, and then you teach them how to apply what you've just explained and illustrated, all right? Cool, let's go through those one by one. The first is explain. This is your core teaching. So let's say we have a newsletter on digital marketing. I chose digital marketing just because I know a lot of you are doing that, but also if you are on the Success Connection, the chances are you have some type of a background in digital marketing, so you might understand the examples that I'm going to use in a little bit. So that's why I chose digital marketing as, as an example for this. But let's say you have a newsletter. On, actually, let me, let me just see in the, in the box how many people say, say, um, say uh, uh, fantastic. If you're doing one on digital marketing or some kind of marketing, put fantastic in the chat box. Some of you have can type fantastic very quickly. That's what I just learned. I would probably have to check my spelling on that. I'm really impressed with the number of people that type that, that quickly. So thank you for that. Okay, so there, there are a number of people that are doing uh, digital marketing as their, uh, as their newsletter. Awesome, so this will make sense to you. All right, so let's say we're doing digital marketing and this newsletter, this lesson that we're going to share is on the concept of nurturing leads. Ooh, sounds very fun, it's very important. Um, how do we explain the concept of nurturing leads? Okay, the first thing we do is we go through the explanation section. So here's an example of how, of how I would explain the concept of nurturing leads, okay? This is an example. I would say, hey, before we understand how to nurture a lead, let's get this question out of the way. What's a lead? A lead is someone who's given you her email address in exchange for free content or a premium. Sometimes they're referred to as subscribers. She isn't a customer yet. That only happens once she makes a purchase. So your job while she's in the lead phase is to build trust and rapport with her through a series of emails that speaks directly to her deepest desires. Often these initial emails are called a nurture sequence because you're caring for your new lead and helping them understand your offer. That's how I would explain nurturing the lead. How many of you know the chat box? Comment one, if you think you can do that. If that's not pretty easy to you, that you're doing a digital, mar okay, yeah. You're doing a digital marketing newsletter and you're like, hey, I'm trying to come up with a lesson. Um, here's a phrase that I heard a guru say one time. He said, nurturing leads. Well, a lot of people don't know what nurturing the lead is. So maybe I can walk through a quick explanation about that and help my subscribers out. How many people, yeah, I see tons of ones here. A lot of people know this isn't hard, guys. This isn't rocket science. This is this is stuff that you've already learned. You just, in a quick little paragraph, explain what nurturing the lead is. The second thing you wanna do is illustrate. So you've given them the core concepts. Now we want to tell them a story to help unpack this concept a little deeper because it's one thing to just say, here's the facts, here's the information, but let's tease it out and let's help them understand a little bit more. Let's give them a case study or an example. So once you finish your core lesson, it's time to illustrate. And the most common way to illustrate something is to tell a story. So here's an example in this digital marketing newsletter where I'm going through what the concept of nurturing leads are. Here's, here's a story that I would share with them to help understand that concept. I would say, meet Maria. She's scraping by to earn extra income so her family can go to Disney World at the end of the year. She's researched methods on YouTube 
but they seem way too complicated or require huge upfront costs, like starting an Amazon store. <laughs> Seeing your ad on Facebook, she thinks this might be what she's looking for. So she opts into your free training and she begins to read the free book. You see how this story is very relatable. It's talking about Maria, but it's probably about a lot of other people as well. But she isn't sold just yet. She's been burned before, confused and overwhelmed. She needs more time and further details before she goes all in. Then she gets your first email from the nurture sequence and it reads that if she had any questions, she could hit reply and respond. Wow, Maria thinks this is a real person. That's different than anything else I've seen online. You're building trust. The next email in your nurture sequence shows the difference between other business opportunities she might find online and yours. So Maria gets excited because she sees you know exactly where she's coming from and, she, and you're answering her most dire questions. The next email in your nurture sequence seals the deal. You tell a story of one of your students who used the money they made from this opportunity to take their family on vacation. That's where the light bulb goes off. Thanks to the nurture sequence, you've now built trust with Maria, answered her most pressing questions, spoken to her greatest desires, and now she's ready to buy. And that's the story. Yep, okay, that's all I had for that. And that's the story of Maria and the nurture's email sequence. So do you see what I did there? I opened up by explaining what a nurture sequence was. I told them about you know, the idea of a lead, what email marketing is, email subscribers, all that. And then I told a story. I said, okay, let's put this in practical terms. You have a woman named Maria. She sees all these opportunities. She opts into something and she's not quite ready to buy, but then she starts seeing emails that start answering questions that she was thinking all along. She's getting warmed up to you. She's built, you're building trust with her. She has rapport. Then she becomes a customer. So anyone that didn't really understand in the explain section what nurturing a lead was, it now clicks. Tell me clicks, thick clicks in the uh, chat box if that makes sense. And please ask me any questions too. Um, I wanna make sure I'm, if I'm going too fast or I'm going too slow for some of you, um, let, let me know, that'd be great. Okay. Let's keep going on because I'm seeing a lot of clicks. So that's the story side of things. The third is the most important section. This is what we call apply. You have E for explain, I for illustrate, and then A for apply. It's time for the most important piece of the puzzle. This is the so what of our newsletter. This portion describes what we do in light of all the helpful knowledge that you've shared already. So here's an example. Now that we know what nurturing leads are, how do we come up with a nurture sequence? Here's my number one tip, and I actually am running a little bit low on time, okay. so I'm not going to get into the details of this, but I'll send this link to you. But this, all this is, friends, um, is I'm just giving actionable advice. I'm saying, hey, Here's the explanation of what it is. Here's a story to illustrate further what, I'm, what the concept I'm trying to share. But now here is some actionable advice that you can apply today in your business to get results. That's the apply section. And no matter what niche you're in, when, if you're doing health and fitness, if you're doing uh, stock picks, um, if you're doing dog training, I don't care what niche you're in, the content should always be have something that you want to explain, have a story that illustrates it, and then finally, um, a section where they can apply something right then and there, all right? So that's E, I, and A. That's the content, that's the meat, that's gonna be the longest part of this whole newsletter and the whole, my whole presentation tonight because that's the most important part. Um, and a lot of you have mentioned that this seems easy. Yes, it, yes it is. It is, it is not hard once you know the structure, once you have the idea. So that's the content, but you're not quite done yet. We have a few other sections that I want you to include. These are quick, I promise, and then I will be out of your hair, friends. The next section is called the question, oh my goodness. This is the, see, this is what happens, Chair, bring her over real quick. We're live, I just got a brand new puppy, and her name is Rita, and say hi, Rita. And she's adorable, and she oh, also, man. <laughs> Rita, what's Rita. up? This is how you know we're live, guys. And Rita loves more than anything else, more than kibbles, 
more than walks. She loves to bite on my computer cords. Thank you, Cherith. I love Lisa's. Thank you. She loves to bite on your computer cords. I love it. Just get ready. That's his new dog. So he, this is new for him. This is the new yeah. life. So you just wait, <laughs> homie. I got two. And and oh, look, man. dogs dogs are like Pringles. You can't just eat one. You know. You know what I'm saying? You can't stop yeah. after one. Yeah. You, you, you eat your dogs. Well, it's the, the, that was, I was, no, but the yeah, well, I was gonna mention earlier when I was hearing the dogs barking, I was like, I'm about to join that club with you guys yeah. where the we're live on the success connection and you can hear my dogs. I mean, it just is what it is, man. It is what it is. It's the way it goes. So I'll let you keep going. I won't interrupt. No keep problem. <laughs> my little angel here. All right, I'm gonna wrap up here, guys. It's not gonna go much longer. The next section is gonna be question and answer. So this portion of your newsletter is designed to engage with your customers. Uh, you want them to know that you truly care about them. You care about their questions at any point. Um, even though you have a set path in motion for your newsletter, they're allowed to derail you with a question. They're allowed to, to ask you a question out of the blue. This is their time. They're the ones that are paying for this newsletter. So you want to make sure you have some part of your newsletter letter that lets them know that um, you are free to answer any questions that you might not cover in the normal cadence of your newsletter, okay? Um, now, I'll say this, Q&A works great when you have a lot of subscribers because the more subscribers you have, the more questions you're going to get throughout the month. Trust me, for the PWA newsletter, the newsletter is not even the feature of the Partner with Anthony program. It is a very, very, very small part but I still get tons and tons and tons of questions and it's awesome because it helps give me content. It helps me give me things that I can share with my subscribers. So Q and A's are great. If you don't have a lot of subscribers to start off, um, one thing that you could do is go on Google, go on Quora and find common Q and A's on Google that are related to your niche and answer those questions that can help, that, that'll help get you started, help get the wheels turning, okay? This can also be a time to highlight a member who's done well or shared a valuable insight. Sometimes I do on the PWA newsletter, uh, just a member highlight, someone in the group who's made a great comment, someone who's made some sales, it's a great time to just share what they share, um, celebrate their success and let people know they're, they're being seen. Um, the con if they take action, they should be rewarded for that um, and they should be congratulated for that. So that question and answer time, member highlight is a great time to do that. The next section is called the coming up section. You always, 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 always want to make sure in your newsletter that you are teasing the next newsletter. Uh, marketers call this the open loop. This is the, you explain why the next issue is absolutely can not miss. This keeps readers excited and engaged to open your newsletter. Um, years ago, shows would put on to be continued at the end of the episode to make viewers come back for more. Now, uh, it's become a little more refined. Most television, they have these stories that interweave that just constantly make you want to come back. So if you read through your newsletter and you think to yourself, you know, I really haven't teased out um, why they should stick around for the next newsletter, make sure to go back and include that even if it's just like like this a section that says here's what's coming up the better you get at sharing what's coming up the higher your retention rate's going to be and and, and one of the things one of the things to point out and i just i actually was just filming a youtube video uh which roger is going to be distributing all of our youtube videos coming up in the next uh starting hopefully next week we've taken a little bit of a delay uh, a little bit more time i think i have paralysis in uh in my desire to uh to get it done um but i was just talking about this look the newsletter business can be a lot like a gym business in that there will be a lot of people that sign up and never use it right and those people will stay they'll stay for you know maybe three months maybe they'll stay for six months but the people that stay forever are the people that depend on it and consume it and use it okay depend on it consume it and use it so what that means is the goal of your newsletter like he said should be to get people so jazzed up about next week's edition or next month's edition depending on how you send you know how you're doing yours that they want the information like they're looking for it right one of the best practices for newsletters is to send them on the same day every month at the same time 
So you'll notice that Roger sends ours out every single Monday. So every Monday, our partner with Anthony students know to be looking for a newsletter. If they don't see the newsletter, they know to check their spam. They, they're like, okay, wait a minute. I know this should be sent out. So they proactively go check spam, find the newsletter because sometimes your email clients put it in spam and then they open it and they read it, right? So by, by creating that habit, that habitual you know, thing that people look forward to on a weekly basis or a monthly basis, you get a higher consumption of what you're doing. And that higher consumption rate is going to cause a, long, a higher stick rate, okay? I'll give you a prime example. All of you know that we build a lot of pages for you in ClickFunnels. My ClickFunnels churn rate currently is 0.03%, which that means not even half of 1% of the people that have bought ClickFunnels from me have canceled it in the last 30 days. Like, that's basically where we're at. Now, you can look at that and say, awesome, you're Anthony, that's great, but that's not the case because many people sell ClickFunnels and people cancel it. The reason that I sell ClickFunnels and nobody cancels it is because I have a very high consumption rate. You guys are using it. You're building funnels. We're giving you pages. We're doing things for you. You're consuming, not, you're not just buying, you're consuming and using what you bought. So the newsletters are the same way. You don't wanna just throw them out there, right? You want them to be good. You want them to be things that people desire and they want each and every week. And like Roger said, you want to tease the next one in the current edition, opening that loop that they're like, oh, I just really wanted to see this. And then they wait for it for the next week or for the next month. That's what keeps people active. And that will make you so much more money than just slamming a bunch of crap on a, in an email and sending it out and saying, eh, nobody's going to read it anyway. Right. So quality and value means so much if you lead with value and you lead with quality you'll get longer like uh stick rates and those longer stick rates mean more money for you and obviously more delivered help to the people that have uh that have purchased your newsletters roger can i get a copy of this yeah absolutely so once i once i unshare my screen uns i'll unshare your screen in just a second uh I'm leave it on for just a sec you can uh you can just uh, actually, what you could do is you could just put this on a page, like copy, go into the click funnel, into the funnel that we have for the newsletters real quick and yeah. just copy and paste it onto a page in there, like make a blank page and paste this on it. And that way, when they get the shared funnel tonight, it'll just have that, it'll just name it like Perfect. to do's. So we got, you'll have to do it in the next 10 minutes because uh, I'll be sharing it. So no pressure or anything, be be, but I do want to point something out to everybody. You know how a bunch of people BS you and tell you, oh, I'm going to give you the angle that I'm using. I'm going to give you this that I'm using and that that I'm using. And really, it's crap they used to use, right? <laughs> how many of you know that? You have, you know marketers that do this crap, right? It's like, look at this angle I used to. And it's really some stuff they used three weeks ago that doesn't work. Had no clue this was on your screen. But if you guys look at the bottom of Roger's screen in his download bar, do you see where it says no Amazon? Yeah, <laughs> before. <laughs> These are the videos that I filmed as ads for our partner with Anthony program. And we're using the, the angle of no Amazon. Right. So like when I tell you, we like, I took what was blowing it up for me and I'm making you the premium for that angle. This is what's working. And Roger, is this angle not blown up more on, on our ads than any angle we've done in the last two and a half years? By far. It was funny. Another media buyer mentioned in the, uh, in, in the Slack channel today, he was like, you know, it just seems like, you know, ads fatigue really, really quickly. Uh, is that the case? And he's trying to get me to say yes. And I was like, actually, no, dude, like it's, it, this one's been rocking for months now. Um, now we, maybe we tweak a headline to keep it fresh. Maybe we, you know, you, these little videos you'll see here, these are Anthony kind of making a new uh, intro for, for a video. It's the same messaging though. We just want to keep it fresh, but it's the same idea. Telling yep. people, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> that's it. And that's the thing is sometimes the key is test, 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 test. And then you find, I mean, eventually you find the unicorn. Right. This is, this is my little unicorn and I'm giving it to all of you. We're going to thousand of you get my unicorn. So if you are a partner with Anthony student, number one, do not start using my videos to promote, but you could take this, this free ebook, which we, we're going to give you the image. 
but next week you'll get the book. You can make a, an opt-in page for yourself, run an ad. It's total fire. Let's just put it that way. Roger, we might put that in the in the next uh, PWA newsletter. Or so we might talk a little bit about it. But let me uh, let me steal the screen back. Let's see. I shall make myself the presenter again. Take myself out. All right, perfect. And you can go on and um, and and throw that um, that page into ClickFunnels real fast. So let me I'll show you guys uh, something that I that I did for you real fast. Um, I put the three reasons why you should not start an Amazon business. I put this image into the funnel that we've created for you, which is right here, the main opt-in funnel. So I'm going to give you this this funnel in just a second. For those of you, I know we're we're close on time. I, I try to keep my phone right here. I still have nine minutes though. So you guys hold, bear, bear with me. Um, now when you download this funnel, you will actually get this image located inside of the funnel. Next week, we'll actually give you the PDF itself. So the actual file that you can deliver. Okay. So that's going to be available for you now tonight, along with these seven opt-in pages. And Roger is going to, in just a second, add a, a, a page down here that has all of the notes for how to write a newsletter. That way it's just saved in your funnels. It's just one page and you can always reference it. So obviously nobody would ever go to that page, but you would have it to be able to see these notes and see the structure. Does that make sense everybody? Is that cool? Very good. So let me just kind of pull up our to-do list, okay? And I'm gonna show you some stuff that we're doing. So tonight I gave you the premium image, right? For your page. We also are giving you the seven opt-in pages that we bought from students last week. Those are all loaded. You get those tonight. I'll give you the shared link in a second. And the third thing we did is we walked you through the, the strategies of writing a newsletter, how to write that newsletter so that people come back for more, which makes you more money, right? So we've delivered those things tonight. I told you we we're going to make a few changes and a few pivots, and we are. There are a lot of people that this week have been just up in the air, all over the place. So, you know, so far, nobody in the Success Connection group said they have had coronavirus, but you all know there's hysteria, the markets are crazy, people are just kind of in a state of panic right now. And so what I wanted to do is extend our other contests. Uh, last week, I told you if you if you built, uh, let's right here, if you built three, or if you built an opt-in page, I'm sorry, if you built an opt-in page similar to the ones that all these students have built that I was gonna buy three more as long as you posted them in the group and you use the the, uh, the word hashtag Anthony in the post, okay? I'm not gonna buy those this week, I'm gonna buy them next week. And the reason is I just wanna give everybody time to kind of take a deep breath. We woke up Monday morning and just basically all hell broke loose in the world and it got infinitely worse and has gotten infinitely worse as the week has progressed. And I just wanna give everybody time to take a deep breath relax, have something to look forward to, stay safe, but realize that, you know, uh, life will go on, things will happen, and uh, we need to uh, we need to take care of the people that we need to take care of, but ultimately we still need to take care of our minds and still be pushing forward, moving in the right direction. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna extend this contest until next Thursday. I also said that I'm gonna buy five opt-in pages where you create new copy, right? Meaning I'm not buying the design, I'm buying the copy, the words on the page, right? Is it free traffic resources? Is it some new copy that you write on three reasons not to start an Amazon store and you use this book, right? I'm gonna still do that, but I'm gonna buy that next week. You post it in our Facebook group and you put the hashtag Anthony copy under that one, okay? So step one is you can make a landing page, an opt-in page, put hashtag Anthony, I'll check it. Next week, I'm gonna buy three. Then you can make a landing page and an opt-in page and put hashtag Anthony copy. And that's going to trigger me to look at it for the copy. And I'm going to buy five of those pages from you guys next week for $500, basically. So that's 800 bucks I'm going to give away next week. And then I'm adding this in tonight because I think it's awesome. I'm going to buy three newsletters in the internet marketing niche. All you've got to do is write the newsletter. You can however you want to do it. You can write it on a web page in ClickFunnels, similar to what Roger is about to do, and post it in the group. And or you can write it in a Word document and post it in the group, whatever you want to do. You write a newsletter, okay? Structured how Roger said to structure it. 
as if it would be your very first newsletter that you deliver to, to, to your clients that bought from you, okay? And I'm going to buy three of those from you. So that what I can do is I can take those three newsletters and I can give them to everybody. And everybody will have their first three newsletters to deliver to their clients. The odds of you all having so much crossover and who bought your newsletter is probably pretty slim. So I feel, and plus you can take them and put your own personal tweak on them. So I'm gonna buy three newsletters next week for $300 more, okay? So that's $1,100. So it's $1,100 being given away next week, okay? So we got a lot of stuff to do next week. We got a lot of homework for next week. And that is creating pages writing these these newsletters and doing the things that I feel like can truly help you succeed, okay? So we've got those three contests running and I have volunteered Roger, who does not know this because he is currently uh, trying to add that newsletter to your- what's, uh, what's happening? I heard my name. Yes. Well, I'm volunteering you to write one newsletter for the internet marketing niche that we shall give to them next week. Ah, cool. Roger, I like to keep it fresh. Yeah. On the fly, you look like you were having, so how many of you want Roger to write you a newsletter? <laughs> Come on, raise your hand, say yes. Post in the Facebook group, right? <laughs> Roger, write me a newsletter. If you're in the Facebook group right now, post right now so he can see how much love he's got. Come on, man. So, <laughs> so cool. this will, but here's the thing. This will give you four newsletters to start off with when you launch your business. You'll have four and you can tweak them and change them however you'd like you'll have four basic outlines of newsletters to have for your business when you launch. So next week, big week, three giveaway contests, all of course helping you make more money by learning how to do what you're doing. And then one newsletter written by Roger, he writes to all of our partner with Anthony students, we're talking about 50,000 students or so, and he's writing emails and sending them out to them every single week. So very good at what he does. This is what you want. You only get it next week. You only get it here live on the Success Connection, so you don't need to miss, okay? And then the following weeks, here's what we're gonna do to launch your business. The next week, we're gonna give you the sales page and the actual premium PDF, meaning the download of the three uh, reasons not to start an Amazon business, that thing, okay? We're gonna give you that. Then the next week, we're gonna give you an upsell page, show you how when somebody buys your newsletter, there's one more thing you can sell them to make more money, to make your funnel work. And then the next week, we're gonna launch. So in three weeks time, you're gonna have a full-blown newsletter business, ready to rock and roll, built-in upsells, great premiums, great landing pages, with four newsletters already written for you, ready to deliver to your students, ready to deliver to your customers, right? The minute that they buy. How many of you are excited about that? Maybe yes? All right, I see lots and lots and lots of yes, it's very good. I'm close on time, I'm close on time. I still have two minutes. I'm not gonna make it in exactly an hour, but let me show you how to get all of this stuff, okay? If you're a new student, you wanna join our, our uh, Facebook group. And of course, you also wanna get our funnels because currently Roger is adding all of the information on how to write newsletters to this funnel. Plus, we have our seven student funnels that are in here, okay? So this is super important. So I'm gonna show you something really fast while he does that. This is the Success Connection Student Resource Center. You should be here all the time on, uh, on well, basically on, I guess on, on Thursday nights, you should be here all the time. So let me just kind of go through it real briefly. If you're a new student, you don't have partner with Anthony, there's a link, you can check it out. This is the most important thing up at the top and that is joining our Facebook group, okay? Joining our Facebook group is essential, all right? Essential. So please, please, Join our Facebook group. This is where you're gonna make those posts with hashtag Anthony, hashtag Anthony copy, hashtag Anthony newsletter. If you're not a member of the Facebook group, you can't win any of the cash prizes and you can't connect with all the awesome people in the Success Connection, which is really the biggest benefit, right? So join the group tonight, it's free. Nobody sells anything in there. If anybody does try to sell you something in there, tell them they're full of crap, email me, text me, put it in the Facebook group, we'll kick them out, right? So. We don't allow people to sell anything. It's a safe zone. It's a, it's a zone where you just help each other, okay? Then, obviously, if you don't mind leaving me a review of my book, that would be awesome, but you don't have to. Um, and then you can follow me on YouTube to get weekly trainings. All you gotta do is click that button and go subscribe to my YouTube channel, okay? Subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's very, very important because we have been stockpiling free training that we are just 
blowing through right now. We're getting ready to start uploading it to YouTube every week. And you're going to get this free training every single week, completely free. It's going to cost you nothing. You don't want to miss it. Click the button, subscribe. It's free. Don't be crazy. Okay. Then click funnels. If you do not have click funnels, understand that you need click funnels. In order for me to give you, you know, this page right here, which by the way, now has this on it, in order for me to give you this page so that you can use it, in order for me to give you this page so that you can use it and run your business off of this page, which you would own, in order for me to give you all of the funnels inside of this funnel right here, you have to have click funnels. It's the only way that it works. It's look, it's not, there's there's just simply no other way for me to put it other than you have to have click funnels in order to be able to use these things. And so therefore, I need to make sure that you get it. You can get a completely free trial to click funnels right here. All you gotta do is click this button, you get a free trial. Okay. Now, some of you will say, well, anything you're an affiliate, you make money. Great. Go to clickfunnels.com and just pay for it then. It doesn't really matter to me. You just need to get it, okay? It's the only way we can deliver these assets to you. And these assets are the things that are helping you build your business. And they're the things that are going to truly help you go from where you're at now to where you really want to be. Okay. So get ClickFunnels tonight if you do not have it. Now, why do you need to get it tonight and get it right now? Well, it's because I'm giving you the ability to download all the funnels and all the businesses we've done in the past, including the ones we just built for you. Let's check it out. All you got to do is scroll down to the bottom of this down here and you go way, 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 way down to the very, very bottom. And it says your newsletter business. OK, I've started putting these things in one funnel so it saves you funnels. All you got to do is click this download button right here. OK, this download button right here is going to get you all seven of the student built opt in pages. It's going to get you the opt in page that I built. OK, and it's also going to get you the new page that Roger is putting in there right now that's got all the notes on exactly how to write a newsletter so that you have those notes. You get all of that downloaded, boom, just like that, right into your ClickFunnels account 100%. The only caveat to that is, is that this link and the rest of the links on this page quit working tonight at midnight. They do that because we had students that were posting these links in places they weren't belonging and they were giving people access to my stuff for free. And all I want to get access to my stuff for free is my Success Connection students. So at midnight tonight, these links quit working, which means you have until midnight tonight to download all of these opt-in pages and have all the assets you need to do your homework, which is make more opt-in pages, write more copy and write newsletters and post them in the Facebook group. Does that make sense, everybody? Just give me a yes if it does. Very good, I see lots and lots of yeses. Now, if you're a new student, you can download all of the old businesses that we built. I call them old, they're just the previous. You can get your done for you funnel business. You can get your success challenge business. You can get your Instagram profits business. You can get your YouTube business. All you gotta do, click the download buttons that you see on the screen. All of these download buttons work until midnight. After midnight, they don't work. So you can download all of these businesses tonight and you legit just have every single business that we've ever created here on the Success Connection. I keep it all for you so that you never miss out, right? How many of you like that? Just a big yes? All right. I see lots and lots and lots of yeses. I like it when I see yeses. It's very good that, uh, that all of you are excited about that. Okay. Now, I want to show you really quickly uh, because I believe, yep, I believe that Roger has, uh, has, made this particular hey roger yeah it's in there man yep there's also a, a pop-up on it so just kill the pop-up oh, jeez <laughs> and probably you. delete the content of the pop-up um but anyway you guys can check this out they're inside of the funnel that you're getting tonight for free you'll go down here to the bottom it says outline for creating a paid newsletter and then all you have to do is just click on this button right here and you can see this entire outline that roger put together for you it's all in here and it's not gonna cost you anything to get access to it, okay? So you get that completely free, no cost to you, it is yours, but you must go to this page and get all the things downloaded. So let me give you the access to this page, okay? So let me give you the access. Remember what's going on next week, okay? Your homework is so important. Build your opt-in pages, post them in the group, tag them, hashtag Anthony. Build your opt-in pages, write copy, really good copy, tag them, hashtag Anthony copy. And then 
write your newsletters and you can even write them on pages just like Roger did. And of course, tag them in the group, Anthony Newsletter. And I'm gonna buy all of that from you, $1,100 next week. And Roger's going to be back to give you a newsletter that he writes for the general internet marketing niche that you're gonna get completely free next week, all right here on the Success Connection. And how do you take advantage of all this epicness? You go to this link. There's a link right here, go.bsc.com forward slash funnel. And the password tonight kind of makes sense. It's content. The password tonight is content. So go.bsc.com forward slash funnel. And the password for tonight is content. C-O-N-T-E-N-T, -E content. Because hey, without content, you're not gonna make any money with a newsletter business. So you got to learn how to build the content of that newsletter so that it's great, so that it's awesome, so that it's inspiring, and so that it helps so many people around the world uh, really and truly have success in whatever it is that you're teaching. So go.bsc.com forward slash funnel. The password is content. What I'd love for you guys to do is head over to the Facebook group, leave us a comment. Let me know if you're going to be doing your homework. Let me know if you're going to be making those posts. Let me know what you thought about tonight's Success Connection. And hey, let Roger know what you thought about his training, right? If you want me to keep getting my team on here and these guys to take some of the time out of their day, I mean, it's late, late, late on the East Coast, and yet he's still on here with us live uh, and teaching and training and educating and giving resources. And if we want that, we got to show him some love. We got to let him know that, they, that, that you enjoyed it and you appreciate it. So please, please go to the Facebook group. Let him know. You can click the link inside of, uh, inside of the student resource page here to get into the Facebook group. So for now, Go to go.bsc.com forward slash funnel, type in the password content, okay? And then make sure that you get everything, uh, everything that you need taken care of, all of your homework, get ClickFunnels. If you don't have it, don't be crazy, just get it. It's completely free for two weeks. The biggest thing is, is it keeps you on pace, it keeps you on track. One of the biggest things and the biggest problems people have is they get off track, they're all over the place. Don't get off track. Just stay on track, stay focused, crush it. I'm telling you right now, you can have massive success. And listen, uh, you know, from, from our family, the, the, the Morrison education family, and then just our personal family, I'm sure from Roger's family to all of you, uh, you know, we, we truly hope that, uh, that none of you have been impacted by, uh, by this, this, uh, this virus. Obviously, I always say, you know, on the weekends, have a great weekend and have a safe weekend. I always say that. And so, Use, uh, use your brain, use intelligence, use a little common sense, stay safe, uh, still stay motivated, still stay working. At the end of the day, uh, you know, uh, we've all faced obstacles and, and challenges in our lives. And I truly believe that if we just use good common sense, uh, we can avoid a lot of problems and, uh, and we can keep our trajectory moving forward and moving up. And, and that's what I really want for you. So uh, spend some time this weekend, maybe stay indoors and, uh, and do a little work train a little bit, educate yourself a little bit. Like I say, do something other people aren't doing. So next week you'll be ahead of the game and that is the name of the game. So again, thank you so much for being here, Roger. Shout out to you. Thank you so much for uh, for being on here with us and, uh, and delivering so much value. We look forward to your pre-written newsletter for everybody next week. <laughs> thanks for having me, guys. And I thanks. love to volunteer your time, yeah. energy, and knowledge <laughs> to our students completely free. Guys, go to the link, go.dsc.com forward slash funnel, type in password content, Get everything that you need. Make sure you have ClickFunnels. Make sure you download this funnel. Make sure you're following me on YouTube. Make sure you get into the Facebook group and tell us how much you love this, uh, this training tonight and how much you appreciate, Roger. We'll see you all next week right here, same place, same time, on the Success Connection. Take care, everybody. Good night.